hello friends and welcome to youtube channel freedom tech and in this session what we are going to learn in this session i will create a custom object detection model which detect water leak from the pipes so we will use here roboflow ready to use universal data set and then we will create our own custom object detection model which detect water leak from pipes so before we move to our practical friends if you learn something from our videos please consider to subscribe our channel okay friends thank you so much and let's get started so friends if you don't know how to use yolo 11 for object detection watch my playlist and you will learn lot of things from my yolo 11 object detection playlist simple so today we will uh, create our own custom object detection model which basically detect a water leak from pipes we will use roboflow data set for that simple so for that i have created a new repository i will mention the link inside description box simply copy paste the link inside web browser yolo 11 water leak go to the code click on download zip as we always do and it will download our repository as you can see simple now let's just open our file manager and go to the downloads this is what our repository right click then extract all click on extract and it will extract our repository then we have our repository yellow 11 water leak main again same folder simple so inside that i have mentioned our code uh, for yellow 11 object detection model simple and this is the basic code which detect object and then we have here our video files so as you can see this is the video files where we clearly see there is a, a leak and there is a water leak also simple there is a leak and we can see there is a water basically and we have here another video also and here it is as you can see there is a leak in a wall and there is a water coming out from the wall here it is as you can see so our goal is to create the model which detect water leak uh, we have here another two videos also but we will use this video as a main of uh, goal simple so now uh, for that first we need our data set so inside this data file i have mentioned the universe.roboflow.com the link for data set so just copy the link copy it and open the web browser new tab and press ctrl plus v hit enter it will open the data set link as you can see this is what the link uh, we have your 593 images and now we will train these images for creating our own custom object detection model so simply first let me open google collab machine so friends i have opened google collab and just click on upload click on browse and go to the downloads our folder yolo 11 water leak select the uh, google collab file now it will upload our file so we successfully uploaded file now go to the runtime change the runtime type select python 3 t4 gpu click on save and then click on connect we connected successfully now let's just run our cell one by one so first cell then the next cell where we install ultralytics package then we then of course we need to import the packages so from ultralytics import yolo from ipython.display import display and image and then now again as we always do this code will basically check if the ultralytics is perfectly installed or not so we will use the doc.jpg image and it will cross check so one person one car one dog backpack handbags it means we successfully detect our objects from this image it means we have ultralytics perfectly installed now we want to call our roboflow so here just go to the uh, in data set here we want to select the data set option click on download data set download on my own click on continue then select the yolo 11 yolo 11 and show download code select it click on continue it will create the code just copy from from to yolo 11 copy it and here remove the from to yolo 11 which is our old code and press ctrl plus v it will paste the new code and let's just run the cell it is really easy done we successfully import our data set now let's just click on this 
small folder icon and then here you will see we have dataset folder which we created dataset so dataset inside that we have water leak 3 and then we have data.yml double click data.yml and we will change the path for these three folders so train click on train copy the path remove the path and press ctrl plus v then val valid copy the path remove the path and then ctrl plus v then test copy the path and remove the path and then simply ctrl plus v paste so this is how you need to copy paste the full path for train then valid and test folder now simply press ctrl plus s save the data.yml file and here data is equal to this is the path for data.yml file so this is basically the old path we want to mention the new path so go to the data.yml three dot copy path remove the old path old path of our data.yml and press ctrl plus v it will paste the new path now let's just run our cell it will create our own custom object detection model simple so friends as you can see we have started the training so it will take some time meanwhile i will pause video so friends we have completed our training process and our model is saved inside and runs detect run folder so click on this small folder icon runs then detect and then we have train then we have weights and inside that we have base.pt model so click on download and it will download our model so friends we successfully downloaded our model so let's just close the browser open file manager go to the downloads and this is what our model right click cut your 11 water leak main and then just paste the model done now simply open our full code which is our yola 11 object detection code i have explained this code in several times in my previous video so same code we have here rectangle we have here class id track id confidence level then we have here box class id track id conf is all boxes class id track ids and confidences simple now simply we will mention our uh, uh, model base.pt and then we have our video file so let's just start with five so i will mention here five dot mp4 and if i save the code if i run the code and as you can see friends we are detecting the water water leak here it is as you can see it's detecting the water leak system and now we have here another video which is a six number so six six dot mp4 let's just save it and if i run the code so here it is as you can see it's detecting the crack and there is a water coming out from the crack so it's detecting the water leak here it is as you can see the red color rectangle and here also it's detecting perfect simple so now as i mentioned we i have here more videos so i have here in this folder i have here some more videos so i will simply mention the videos in our repository you will cross check all these videos also so we have one dot mp4 so one dot mp4 let me save the code if i run the code so here it is uh, as you can see friends there is this is the pipe and there is a water leaking and it's detecting also it's detecting perfectly simple so now we have 2 dot mp4 let's just run the code here it is as you can see there is a water leakage and it's detecting simple means our model is perfectly working and here also as you can see simple so this is what friends with the help of roboflow 
now there is no need to uh, train images because there is a ready data set and you can use their data set and you can create your models for your projects i hope you learned something from this video we'll meet our next video till then thank you take care and bye bye